guys welcome to today's video so today's video I'm going to be sharing with you guys something that I do to save a little bit of money while I'm stationed here at Yokota Air Force Base in Japan um, this does only apply to a certain group of people so hopefully if you are coming to Yokota Air Force Base uh, and you have kids and you're looking to save some money, this is the video for you guys. <laughs> so today I have an appointment and I'm gonna take you guys with me. What is this? Okay. Okay. See you guys there. But before I leave, check out this really cool map that I picked up at Costco yesterday and it's really cool it's the scratch off one so it's really not that big but i have been seeing this on pinterest and i've been wanting to order one and i saw it at costco so i bought it and i'll be putting that somewhere in the office still not done scratching out some of the stuff but wow i haven't really traveled <laughs> vlogs again <laughs> so I just got out of the WIC office and for those of you that are coming to Yokota or just military bases in general overseas they do have a WIC program available for families that do qualify for that and let me tell you even if you think you don't need it use it because it definitely saves you money let me say I I keep my receipts and I can tell you I save like about a hundred dollars on groceries alone um, of course this is just at the commissary only applies to food certain foods the only thing I don't like about WIC here overseas is that they um, is that they have these checks <laughs> So if any, any of you that have ever used WIC before, I actually used to have WIC back in the States as well. And they had a little like credit card that was really convenient. You pay for everything and then you just swipe in the WIC, WIC card and it'll automatically take those foods that apply and subtract that amount. But with this, you have to separate everything individually and then put each check with it and... Yeah, it can be really confusing to read sometimes. You know what? I think maybe in a later video, I'll take you guys on a grocery haul specifically for WIC. So if you guys want to see a video on that, be sure to comment below. Let me know and I will do that for you guys. But um, it is very difficult to read and understand if you are new to this type of method. I wanted to share this with you guys because this is something that I do to save money while I'm overseas. And not only that, but why not take advantage? I mean, there's a lot of sacrifices that families have to go through and traveling and all of that. And let me tell you, being here in Japan, food here is really expensive. Fruits and vegetables are definitely on the higher end, which is why I like to use the WIC. And everything else, you know, I shop at multiple areas, but I definitely take advantage of the WIC program that's here overseas. I hope that this helps you guys when you're PCSing here and just give out a little bit more information. Of course, I can only speak with, about my experience with WIC and what I'm doing, but this is something that I thought might be helpful for all of you that are watching, that are coming here. So... I will see you guys on my next video because I gotta go to the gym, so... Okay. Peace. Welcome to the episode. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm just vlogging. <laughs>